saying is there's no great bands with bad drummers, right? Because the drums are the most powerful instrument in the band and can control the band in every way. Like, obviously, tempo and time, but also dynamics. Like, if I play loud, the band's going to play loud. If I play soft, the band will play soft. So you, you really have a lot of control over the ensemble. So when I sit down, I got to sit, I got to stop for a second and go, what is my intention right now? What am I doing? Is this exciting? Is it beautiful? Is it, you know, what's about to happen? And, um, you know, and then take that path. It's all relative to obviously what music we're playing, but that's the basics of it. I, I'm like the most diversified music listener ever, because I, I, I have like, I'll have Peter Gabriel and then symphony stuff and then straight ahead stuff and then Tower of Power, and then Tool, then Rush, then it's all over the place. So I totally go in phases. I'll get into like a tool rush mode and it'll be a month of that and then it'll be all swing and then it'll be all straight. But I, I'm always listening to different stuff. Um, as I've gotten older, I definitely love um, things that have a lot of statement in it from a musical standpoint. I mean, everyone here that's playing for this event that we're doing for this tribute to the big band uh, greats, it's, these are all guys I listen to all the time. I mean, Steve's my friend and and, and I always listen to what he's doing, and Peter, and, and Dennis, and Adam, and all of them. Jeff, you know, Jeff's solo records with his trio are awesome. And there's a lot of drummers that I love, like Andre Ciccarelli, and, uh, you know, David Garibaldi, and Manu Cache, and different guys. So, in my car right now, I have, I found, I'm always, I'm trying to find really cool, rare recording things. So I found live Peter Gabriel records from these tours in like 07 and 10 and 14 that you could only buy from Peter's website and they have to be sent on CD from England and they're like way deep in the rarity thing. So I got those in the car and I've been wearing those out. So. For me, Arrival, you know, my my band and, and what we do with that band, There's we got six albums with that band. That's like the most exploration of, you know, artistry of stuff. But I, I still get to do cool stuff. We just finished uh, Julia on HBO, the series there, and a bunch of different movie things. And um, I'm still plowing along, <laughs> doing all that. So, and, and I just did Michael Blue Blaze new record.